tonight, just who else at the Acker Showgrounds for the Bayalistic Challenge presented by Ensure My Ride and Troy Bayless Events. It's been a long time since we've had racing at the Ecker, and I tell you what, with the turnout we've got tonight, I think we should do a bit more of it. Mate, um, you keep coming up with little events that seem to be doing pretty good. Yeah, this one's a little bit, little bit bigger to the whole Moto Expo. It's been pretty good. It's been a lot of work in behind the scenes. It's been going on for a long time. Yep. But um, yeah, this looks like it's been a bit of a success, I think. Uh, a lot of people here tonight for the scramble, but you know, a lot of these people would have come straight from the show uh, on closing hours and come for it as well. But if you look in the stands, it looks pretty good. That's for sure. Come running over and have a chat with Chris and yes, you know, yeah. Chris from Milan. It, it's pretty special yeah. for someone like me and a lot of the fans to be able to see you guys in a team environment yeah. and really getting along because it's such an yeah. individual sport, motorcycling. It is, you know, me and Chris were teammates for quite a few years there and um, he was the best teammate I ever had. We could always talk about what we needed to do. Yeah, right. So we always got on really well at the track. And you're still getting on? Yes. It's great fun, you know. I, I remember coming here as a kid. I watched Jason Crump with all the legends on Speedway yeah, Bikes going around here. You know, and I was 10 years old, so I thought the place was massive. But I turned up today, and it's actually quite tight. But what an atmosphere, you know. Troy's done a great job with this crowd, the lineup of riders. You know, 20 great riders out there, and it's just race after race after race. If the crowd aren't getting their money's worth of entertainment, well, there's something wrong, you know. It's, I'm bugging, <laughs> but it's good fun. There's a lot of riders in here with big smiles on their faces. Like yes. you're one of them. Yeah, definitely, you know, and of course I want to. I'd love to go out there and win it, but realistically, there's so many fast riders here, and I'm just here to have fun. I've got a team full of great guys, you know, Robbie Buckman. I raced when I was a junior, and he hasn't dirt tracked for 15 or 16 years, you know, and he's just got the biggest grin on his face. So there's, there's a great lineup of people, and we're just having a good time. Three, three, four, them. What's it like riding at the Echo? Oh, it's unbelievable, like just the crowd and the atmosphere compared to a normal race inside this stadium. I've been to a few big long track meetings before in the past and it doesn't compare to this, this is unreal. It's like a Coliseum, isn't it? Yeah, no, it's, it's awesome. The crowd's getting right behind us tonight and, um, and hopefully it should be a great final, 15 laps, anything can happen, so no, it should be good. Australia's favourite stunt rider, mate. You doing a bit of dirt track tonight? Yeah, I thought I'd, uh, I thought I'd give it a go. I've, I've um, I don't know. It's like a newfound love of motorcycling I've got. I tried it last year, late last year. Loved it. Awesome going sideways. And um, yeah, I did it again. Did it again just after Christmas. And here I am. Bayless said to me, "Come and race the industry scramble." So yeah, it'd be fun. That's awesome, mate. Um, so this is good practice for you, drifting the, the drift bike, I Surprisingly hope. different. I thought, yeah, cool, you know, like I can drift the 990, this would be great. <laughs> but you know, this one, you're constantly chasing front end grip and, you know, to go fast, you've got to have front end grip, but to get front end grip, you've got to go fast. So, you know, I'm used to going fast on a 990 with front end grip, yeah. sideways, great. So it's nice, it's a new challenge. I have been challenged on a bike for a while, so I'm really enjoying it. Yeah, something completely different and like there's so many legends here and so many people that have done so many, you know, achieved so many great things and amazing things. It's uh, 
you know, it's, it's, a, it's an honor for me to be able to do it, and yeah, I just can't wait to get raced. Michael Curtis, mate, um, usually racing against Troy Bayless, but tonight you're on his, on his team. Yeah, uh, pretty excited, it should be a good night. Troy rang me up to see if uh, I was interested to come to a team's thing, and I said absolutely, and he asked if I wanted to be on his team or against him, and I told him if, if he wanted to keep him in his events, he'd better put me on his team. <laughs> So you actually got Paul Tassig on your team, mate. Yeah, that's, a bit of a, so. <laughs> that's a pretty good uh, score. <laughs> yeah, no, he's funny. He knows everything about the sport, so, so it's good to learn from him. Has he been throwing you on your tips? He's trying. He's trying? But, yeah. Are you going to listen to him? Try my best, but <laughs> <laughs> play it by ear on the track, I guess. Cheers, mate. Good luck. Insane, I know, but that is just the way it goes. Hats off to uh, Troy Bayless again. Nah. Mate, what can you say? You know, such a humble, humble champion, great friend, you know, like, yeah, I, I would have been retired. Honestly, I would have been retired, washed up at home, probably not doing a great deal, you know, with my family, obviously. But um, to have this invitation from Troy to be involved in the Legends at the Classic two years ago and then again this year, and and now this, and yeah, it's, it's an honor. show that will happen will be in November and that will be at Melbourne. It's like this year it's like um, Brisbane and then Melbourne and next year it's Sydney. That's how it goes. Um, so we'll see what happens down in Melbourne. It's a little way off yet. But yeah. Mate, thanks for bringing it here. It's awesome. Mate. Yeah, no, I'm really happy to have it up here. Um, you know, I love looking at all the new marks, new models, and um, but it's just nice to get them out and let people actually see some action at the same time. Brilliant, mate. Thank you very much. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Bye.